Federal legislation pushed by Democrats could increase the minimum wage to $15 across the nation. KSNT's Lindley Lund joins us live to tell us what concerns local experts and business owners alike have to say about this. Lindley? Yes, Kelly, this legislation change would cause local businesses like Norseman Brewing Company here in North Topeka to have to raise their minimum wage each year until it reaches $15 in 2025. And all this, although this does seem like a good change, the owners here say that there are some reason for concern. From the bartenders to the wait staff, Jared Rudy, one of the owners of Norseman Brewing Company, knows it's important to pay his employees a livable salary. But when he found out the Biden administration and Democrats were pushing for a national increase in minimum wage, he had some apprehensions. The cost of living in the Midwest is way different than the coast or in big cities like New York City. Um, Washington, D.C. He started thinking about the changes he would have to make if this does go into effect. Decreasing costs um, and while trying to increase revenue would, would take priority. Uh, you know, we may have to, for example, try to uh, negotiate lower prices with our suppliers to even possibly having to raise prices on certain products. To, if worse comes to worst, having less employees. And he wouldn't be alone. Paul Byrne, an economics professor at Washburn University, says about 30 percent of employees in Kansas would be affected by this wage change. Depending on how much firms respond by reducing employment, uh, you could expect anywhere between you know, 5 to 14 percent of those workers may end up losing their jobs. Both Rudy and Byrne agree it makes more sense to have this legislation decided at a state or local level instead of national. Local politicians, whatever side of the aisle they are, they're on, they're going to you know, focus more uh, intently on what the local impacts are, whereas you know, people analyzing it from, from the coast aren't going to think a whole lot about what's going, how this is going to impact uh, Kansas. But Rudy is also noticing positives. Putting more expendable money in their pockets could uh, translate into an increase in local spending. And this wage change is part of President Biden's coronavirus relief package, which lawmakers hope to begin considering next week with an end goal of passing it by March. Live in North Topeka, Lindley Lund, KSNT News.